Can Japan and Toyota win the solid-state battery race? Rivals are also chasing an electric vehicle breakthrough to take on Tesla in the race of produce the, to produce the next generation of advanced batteries for electric vehicles. Japan's and Toyota's rivals are also gathering. So can Toyota take pole in the solid-state battery race? Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com and Torque News YouTube channel. If you are here first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily electric tesla vehicle news and also ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage also please give us thumbs up if you find this report informative so techwire asia has a very interesting report by dashwen jit kaur talking about asking questions if toyota can take the poll in the solid state battery race the search for the battery may be over after a multi-year industry-wide effort has japan solved the elusive solid state technology Technology equation, Japan once supplied the world with the most advanced Li ion batteries, but was overtaken by China and Korea now with Catal, LG Chem, and SK Innovations in the race to produce the first electric car with a solid state battery. Toyota is in the lead, says TechWire. Let's see in what way. As legacy automakers around the world reach for a battery broke breakthrough, Japan's rivals seemed to be charging into the race and leading it. The world's biggest car producer in 2020, Toyota Motors, has been considered a front runner to produce a commercially viable solid state battery. In fact, the car maker plans to announce a prototype of a car powered by solid state battery by the end of this year and seeking to launch a vehicle in the early 2020. You can learn more about that based on Asia Nikkei Asia's report at Torque News YouTube channel by searching Toyota Solid State in YouTube and Torque News. We have a big coverage on that. Now, the quest for a solid state battery has been heating up lately as it would be more stable and faster to charge your electric vehicle than the lithium ion batteries used today by innovative car makers ranging from Tesla of the United States to China's BYD. The compet competition to develop a solid state battery is about gaining an advantage in a fast approaching era when many more consumers are going to be buying their first electric vehicles. Part of a transition from an auto industry that runs mostly on gasoline and diesel to one that runs mostly on electricity. Legacy automakers are hoping that their battery partners will give them an edge and help to close the gap. The two biggest drawbacks of electric cars, limited range and slow charging, will likely persist until battery makers can solve the dendrite problem. It's estimated that a solid state car could have a range of 1000 kilometers, which is 621 miles and take 10 minutes to charge. Solid state batteries deteriorate less over time and Toyota aims to retain 90% of batteries performance over a 30 year lifespan. Toyota leads the solid state battery patent count owning over 1000 patents related to the technology. I mean, imagine Toyota has more than 1000 patents related to solid state battery technology. So what's being done in Japan to help accelerate the development of the technology, the Nikkei reports that the Japanese government is considering spending part of a new 2 trillion yen, which is 19.2 billion US dollars, decarbonization fund in building a solid state battery production infrastructure in the country. Industrial firms such as Mitsui Kinzoku, petrol company Izemitsu Kosan and Sumitomo Chemical are all gearing up or gearing up to make solid electrolytes. Toyota has been pursuing a next generation battery for over a decade, making the largest number of patent applications for solid state batteries from 2014 to 2018, according to a report by the European Patent Office and the International Energy Agency.
Toyota vowed at an earning conference on May 12 to sell 8 million electrified vehicles in 2030, with fuel cell vehicles and electric vehicles accounting for a quarter of that estimate. Then, in April 2020, Toyota established Prime Planet Energy and Solutions, a joint venture with Panasonic to develop vehicle batteries with a focus on solid-state batteries. Another Japanese automaker, Nissan, expects a solid-state battery prototype vehicle by 2028. Separately, as per Nikkei Asia, Japanese industrial manufacturer Hitachi Zosen has developed a solid-state battery claimed to harness one of the highest capacities in the industry. Additionally, the Osaka-based company states this new solid-state battery can operate under a large range of temperatures. It will soon be tested in industrial machinery and space. The Japanese company said its new breakthrough battery offers a capacity seven times greater than its previous models. The Japanese-built solid-state battery has a capacity of 1,000 mAh. Additionally, it can operate within a temperature range of minus 40 Celsius to, minus one, uh, to plus 100 Celsius. That's minus 40 to 212 degrees Fahrenheit. Hitachi Zosen even announced an agreement with the Japanese Aerospace Exploration Agency to test its solid-state batteries in space. Basically, the intensifying global battery race, friends, is a challenge for Japan, but it's a challenge for other countries as well. China, for example, and South Korea, they rapidly eroded the country's dominance of the market for lithium-ion batteries, the previous standard for battery power that is the most common battery used in majority of devices today, from cell phone to Tesla vehicles to other electric cars. And the reason why Japan's government has realized the importance of being the front-runner of the next evolution in battery innovation and is spearheading the commercialization of the latest battery technology. Well, friends, let me know what you think. Do you think Toyota can take the poll in the solid-state battery race? Do you think that uh, can Japan and Toyota win solid-state battery race? You know, what would you say about the rivals? Cattle, SK Innovation, LG Chem, Panasonic. But where is Toyota standing in this with its 1000 battery patent? I would like to hear your thoughts on this and why Tesla is not pursuing solid-state batteries. I understand Tesla started doing some research on that, then abandoned it, um, uh, displaying some things that solid-state batteries cannot do, but there is a lot of research going on with solid-state batteries, which may become the next generation solid-state batteries. But I think to, uh, Tesla is coming up right now, will come, with, will come up with its 4680 batteries sooner than Japan or Toyota will come up with solid-state batteries. I would like to hear your thoughts. This is Armin Haryan from Tortnews.com. Friends, subscribe to our channel, please, for daily Tesla electric vehicle Toyota battery news. And also ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. And also, please um, give us thumbs up if you found this report informative. Have a great day. God bless you, everyone, and see you soon.